the rubber band instantly vanishes. And the band floats between the magician's hands. The magician links the rubber bands and then unlinks them. The rubber band breaks in half and then is impossibly restored. The paper clip visually moves down the band. I'm also going to show you how to slowly melt a rubber band through your fingers. This fools magicians, so definitely learn it. Hey, how's it going everybody? Oscar Owen here, and in this video, I'm gonna be teaching you some amazing magic tricks with rubber bands. Now, I've made sure that all of these magic tricks are really visual, and most of them are really quick and easy to learn as well. So go and grab some rubber bands, and I'll see you at the card table. This is a very fast and easy effect that everybody should know. The magician wraps the band around his fingers cleanly. He then closes his fist, and the rubber band instantly jumps fingers. Here is how. You can learn this magic trick in about 30 seconds, so take any rubber band and wrap it around your fingers twice, like this. Then close your fingers, and as you do that, you want to pull back on the band, and you want to put all your fingers inside this loop, and then let go. It's very simple, and when you do this, you don't want your hand down like this, but you want your hand face up so the spectators can't see that all your fingers are in the loop. Now, all that happens is when you open and close your hand, the band will visually jump. This is a really cool flourish that you can do with any rubber band. The band twirls around your finger like this. Take a normal rubber band and put it on your first finger. Then twist it and put it onto your middle finger like this. Then come in with your thumb and place it in between the band like this. Then all you're going to do is release your middle finger and the band spins around your first finger. If you're looking to learn some of the best magic tricks ever created, then check out my book, Mind-Blowing Magic Tricks for Everyone. Inside, I teach over 50 mind-blowing magic tricks with cards, coins, and everyday objects that you can take with you to any social situation and basically amaze whoever you're with. Most of the tricks also have QR codes that you can actually scan, which then takes you to a video of me performing the trick, which just makes learning everything so much faster and easier. So if you want to help support the channel and learn some amazing magic tricks that literally only take a few minutes to master, then please click the first link in the description below. The magician breaks the rubber band in half. He cleanly shows it to the spectator and then impossibly puts it back together. You can do this with any band and everything can be inspected. This is yet another trick you can learn in 30 seconds. Take a normal rubber band and hold it between your thumb and first finger. Then pull down on the band and then using these fingers, come in and grab it. Then loop this end around and clamp it between your thumb and first finger like this. If you now pull on this section of the band, it looks as if you've got a complete band in your hand. So to begin, hold the band like this, showing that you've got a complete rubber band. Then let go with your thumb to apparently break the rubber band just like that. Show this to the spectator for two seconds just to get that image in their head and then come in with this end of the band and pretend to put it back. And all you're doing is clamping it back between your thumb and first finger. And now what you can do is pull and say, look, the band's complete. And then all you need to do finally is release these fingers here and the band will just spring out and you can show that it's a whole rubber band again. Watch carefully as the paper clip melts through the rubber band slowly and visually. Everything can be inspected. The best part about this trick is that it requires no gimmicks. Use any rubber bands and paper clips you like. This is a really easy effect that just requires two rubber bands and a paper clip. Attach a paper clip to one of the rubber bands and then place that rubber band between your ring fingers with the paper clip at the bottom. Now place your first two fingers inside the rubber band like this, and you now have two rubber bands. Here's where the secret move happens. Your thumbs are going to come over all the rubber bands and then under the bottom rubber band to lift it to the top. Now you can see there's multiple gaps in between each of these. 
rubber bands. Just place your first two fingers in the first gap, your middle fingers in the middle gap, and your ring fingers in the final gap, and then release your thumbs. This creates the illusion that the paper clip is on the top, when in reality it's just been stretched there. Now, to move the paper clip down, shake the rubber band, and just release your first two fingers, and it will look as if it's moved down one rubber band. Then keep shaking and release your middle fingers, and it will look as if it's moved down again. And finally, release your ring fingers, and it will look as if the paper clip has traveled down all four bands. The rubber band slowly melts through the magician's finger. This is hyper visual and a magician fooler, so make sure you learn how to do it. Again, this takes 30 seconds to learn. Take a normal rubber band and place it around your middle finger like this. Then pull back on the rubber band slightly and close all your fingers. Then what you're gonna do is loop this band back around your middle finger, but making sure these two fingers stay together. So you loop the band around your finger like that, and then you can see there's a bit of the band here and a bit of the band here. If you close your hand inwards, it hides this section of the rubber band. So now it looks as if there's just one rubber band looped around your hand, when in reality it's making this weird position here. Then what you do is just slowly drag this rubber band, and it looks as if the band is melting through your fingers, and then you can show everything to be normal. The magician has two rubber bands, rubs them together, and the bands impossibly link. He then rubs the bands again, and they unlink. Everything can be inspected. This is a really simple magic trick that you can master in less than a minute. So take two rubber bands, ideally different colours, and stretch one rubber band between your first two fingers. Then stretch the other rubber band between your ring fingers like this. Now what we're gonna do is come in with your thumbs and you see the bottom band here. What you're gonna do is lift it up and over the bottom half of the top rubber band like this. Then come in with your middle fingers and just place them in the gap you've just created and then release with your thumbs. So you should now be in this position here. Now once you're here, you're basically gonna do exactly the same thing again. So come in with your thumbs, lift this band up and over the one above it, and then release with your middle fingers, and then put your middle fingers where your thumbs now are, and then release with your thumbs. Now it looks as if we've just got two rubber bands in our hand, which we do, but now they're actually linked here, and they're linked here. So get into this position, and then you're ready to begin. Now what you need to do is simply come in with your middle finger and thumb, and rub these two bands together, releasing the little loop that you had on your middle finger, and when you let go, it looks as if the rubber bands have now linked. Then what you need to do is come in with your other middle finger, rub the bands together, let go of everything, and the bands have now unlinked, and you can hand both of these out to be inspected. The magician has a rubber band, and it instantly vanishes. This is a great magic trick for the camera. Take any rubber band and put it around your wrist like that. Then come in with your other hand and pull out and then twist the band around once. You then want to put this hand into the hole that you've just created and pull back. Now it looks like you've got just a rubber band in your hand when in reality it's also looped around your wrist. All you need to do is then let go and the rubber band vanishes, and you need to make sure that this hand is wide open, as this hides the fact that the rubber band is actually on your wrist. The band jumps from hand to hand in a very visual sequence of moves. This is another really good magic trick for social media. Take a normal rubber band and loop it around these four fingers. Then pull down on it, and twist it around once, and then twist it around twice, and then in this bottom gap here, place all your other fingers like this. Now what you need to do is drag the band so it's below your knuckles on both hands. The way this illusion works is you close your bottom hand and it looks as if the band is just looped around your top fingers. Then at the same time, you close this hand and open up this hand, and it looks as if the band has jumped between both hands. 
the magician has a green and a yellow rubber band. These are clearly separate. He then impossibly links the two bands. The bands are now connected. Take two bits of double-sided tape or glue and just place them onto your first finger and thumb. Then loop on the normal rubber band onto your thumb and then take the broken rubber band and stick it to your fingers like this. This means you've got a rubber band between these two fingers and when you close them, it looks as if you've got a complete rubber band in your hand. So to begin, close these two fingers and show you've got a normal pink rubber band and what appears to be a normal green rubber band. Then put your fingers down and let the pink rubber band fall into the green rubber band just by opening up these two fingers slightly. Then close your fingers again and now it looks as if the two bands are impossibly linked. The magician takes the band, visually splits it, and then restores it. Take a normal rubber band and hold it between your thumb and middle fingers in both hands, leaving about this much in the middle. Then come in with your first fingers and pull back on the top of the band like this, and then your first fingers, these two parts, you want to put together. This creates this position, and when you open your hands up like this, it creates the visual illusion that the band is split in half, and then put them back together, and the band has been restored. And then to show everything's completely normal, just release these two fingers and hand the band out for inspection. The magician takes the rubber band and drops it onto his palm. He then repeats the move, but this time the band impossibly floats. This trick requires you to have invisible thread. This is just a very thin loop of elastic that you can't see with your eyes. I've left a link down in the description to where you can get it. It's very cheap and I'd highly recommend it because you can do loads of amazing tricks with this gimmick. Now, I'm gonna show you how this works, not using this, but using another rubber band taking the place of the invisible thread just so you can see what's going on. So what you'd normally do is take this invisible thread and put it around your hand like this, so it's around these four fingers and your thumb. Let me show you what that's like if I used a rubber band in placement. So imagine this is the invisible thread. All you do is place it around your hand like this. Then you take the normal rubber band and place it on top. Then you pick up the band normally and drop it. And then the second time you pick up the band, you pick up the invisible thread and the rubber band together, like this. And then when you drop the rubber band, you keep hold of the invisible thread and it looks as if the band is floating in between your hand. And then whenever you want it to drop, you just release your first finger and everything falls down and you can then hand this out. Thanks for watching and please check out my book below.